there's a dilemma to me. The, the dilemma is that Allah affirms this book while at the same and tells the Christians to judge by this book, right? If they were to judge by this book, they would have to say if they're consistent that the Quran is false because it obviously contradicts what it teaches in there. The word Muslim means the one who submits their will to God. Okay. That's all that means. The word Islam means submission to God. Let's say they, they read the Quran uh -huh. and they came to the conclusion that Muhammad is not a prophet but they do affirm that there's one God, they just don't accept Muhammad as a prophet. Are they a Muslim? I would say that's between them and their creator. But in Arabic, you would still refer to him as a Muslim. Really? Yes. Okay, interesting. I, I, that's interesting. Okay. It's God. It's God. It's God. So you believe that Jesus was a Muslim because yes. he simply just submitted, submitted him with, with to, God, to yes. God. So even if... Uh, even if Jesus didn't have, let's say, if someone doesn't have the same doctrine as, I guess, that Islam teaches, all they need to do is submit their will to God who they believe alone. is God alone, and we they'll believe, be... That's what the Quran says, right? We believe that Allah says in the Quran, right? I think um, those who, uh, I think it says in chapter 2, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. So it says, indeed, the believers, Jews, Christians, and Sabians, whoever truly believes in Allah and the last day and does good will have their, their reward with their Lord and they will have no fear for them and nor will they grieve. Yeah. So I truly believe, bro, that's chapter if you're, two, right? if you're, yeah, chapter two, verse 62 of the yeah, Holy Quran, right? right? I'm not one of those crazy Muslims like that. You know, I'm very, uh, Obvious, yeah, you yeah, are, you're yeah. different, man. Yeah, you're yeah, a different yeah. breed, yeah, chill. Yeah. Uh, you have a, a, a awesome demeanor with this, sure. talking Thank to you. you. I mean, I'm random. Thank you. You know, you Thank stopped you. to, you, know, you was on your way out, yes. decided, and it's been like, what, 20 minutes now, according to the time? Yeah. About 20 minutes, you talking to somebody, right? I, I pre you're, you're course, cool for this, dude, so. I don't uh, believe yeah. in accidents, my dude, but I believe everything has a purpose and a reason behind it. Yeah. And I know we didn't meet on accident either. For sure. Okay, so uh, I guess one more question then, because yes, yes, uh, I don't want to hold you too long, but as long as you're willing to stay, I'm going to sure. drill you. I mean, hey, hey, I, I'm hungry. I got dinner, man. <laughs> you, you, might look, you might look good in the next 10 minutes. You know, oh, yes, six, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's you know good, that's good, wow. Yeah, go ahead. Is, the, is the time still going? Because it usually kind of stops at 20. At 20 minutes, right? Yeah. How do you know? You got the same camera? Yeah, bro. Dude, I need oh, something so else. Annoying. Why does it do that? I don't know. It used to stop at 29. Uh -huh. And then I would have to re re restart re it. But, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, so it's still going. Yeah. You right. have a YouTube channel or something? I, I do. It's, it's called uh, God Logic Apologetics. So I, oh, I don't... Oh, you talk to shit with mine, I do, right? yeah, oh. yeah. So hey, a lot of people think... Why did you look so bad, though? Dude, a lot of people think that we're enemies. We're not... Uh, like there was like we had what people think is a scuffle. Uh, even it was off camera. After that, we shook hands and stuff like that. So I mean, we're not friends by any means. We're di you know we have differences, but I mean I don't I don't hate the guy. I don't dislike the guy. Sure, 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 you know. Uh, I have a different sense. style than him. I, yeah. I do have a different style. Yeah, it, it is. Yeah. yeah, usually so. With with this, it's not debate. Exactly. You know, with, with, I, I enjoy having conversations. Yeah, with, with, yeah, with with Uthman. It's uh, More debate. <laughs> yeah, yes, yes. and so like with, with these questions, he will immediately go on the Drill, yeah, 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 he start you know, and it's not like discussion type. So yes. I, I do appreciate yeah, like do you have different styles? Not not condemning nobody, you know. Yes. Some people are debate like debate. Some people like more discussion and stuff like that. And I'm I'm open for both. So I just believe yeah. in debates. The only winners of the debates are those who are listening. Yes, the ones of who are debating themselves are not going to change their position. Of course, of course. So yeah. it's like the only winners of the debate is the listener, right? So the best thing, I, my approach, is just have a hard to have card. Yeah. Just genuine. Yeah. Just be genuine. That's yeah, it. exactly. Just be real, and hopefully, you know, real, recognize real. Yeah. You know yeah. I'm not used to this. <laughs> well, actually, because you know, we used to say the yeah, 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 yeah. The <laughs> yeah, they, yeah, yeah, they, they don't, they don't, they don't like. Me, but I, I visited a mosque uh, in Vegas a few weeks ago and they were awesome people. Awesome, awesome. They had the conversation on camera, didn't care. They was uh, 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 posing for the cameras. It was fun. It was, it was a fun experience. So uh, and you seem pretty chill too. I, I promise you, I am. Okay. You know, I, I don't, I don't, I don't go out saying what I am. But you know, I let people, do, you know, decide Judge for themselves. For you know, Absolutely. if they don't like, a lot of people don't like me because I, I do critique Islam. I do uh, have my issues with it. My my criticisms of it, sure, sure, sure. Um, and I get caught in Islamophobe because of it. Um, but for me, yeah. when, when I hear these type of things, bro, the biggest Islamophobes, right? The people who critique Islam, hate Islam, end up becoming the best Muslims. Mm. So for me, I, I, that doesn't bother me, bro. <laughs> I, it says in the Quran very clearly that truth stands out clearly from falsehood, yeah, right? I agree. So yeah. let the let the truth speak for itself. Exactly. Bro, that's it. No hate. You know, there no, is no hate. That. There is no no discrimination. None of that, bro. Yeah. Hey, if that's what you believe, that's cool, bro. You can believe whatever you want, bro. Yeah. So good, Jesus. Okay, yeah. for sure. Okay, so. Um, and this, will, this is probably a, a deeper subject, so we don't got to give like super answers now, but 
So, uh, the, saying that the Quran, like uh, you were saying that it's in its perfect language, what is your belief about the preservation of the Quran? Do you believe that it was preserved word for word, letter to letter, dot for dot, since the time of Muhammad all the way till now? Or do you believe that maybe there are textual variants, but there's like, but the meaning and message of the Quran is preserved? Yes, absolutely. Like, for instance, there's different, like, for instance, um, uh, you know, there's different accents to the Quran. For instance, like, uh, let's say if I talk in a British accent, I talk in an Australian accent, yeah. right? Then I talk in an American accent yeah. or a Texas accent, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm still saying the same thing, but the accent is slightly different. Yeah. We have that a little bit with the Quran. Same word, well. same word. different. Stuff. You're saying the same thing. I said, hello, mate. You know, it's, yeah. like, it's just a completely different accent, but I'm saying the same word. Same it has word. the same meaning and yeah. all that. Yeah. So, okay, so uh, when, when I've studied like this, this idea of the preservation of the Quran, I, I get mostly I get this answer the, uh, the answer about dialects and it's the same word but different people pronounce things differently and so uh, that's what they had to like deal with at that time right and so but when I look deeper into it like and I compare certain karyats I see different words I, I don't know Arabic but I can do word study and stuff like that right and so like uh, just a simple one, not saying it changes the context, but one that I, usually Muslims are uh, familiar with are uh, Malik and Malik, right? Uh, you know, uh, owner of the Jay of Judgment or king of the Jay of Judgment. Are you familiar with this? Uh, very? I don't speak Arabic. Oh, okay. I, I've, I've been I've been also about 10 years now. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's only, it's only been 10 years on my journey so far. Okay, no, no problem. Yeah, so so I'm, I still have a lot to learn myself. Really, okay, for sure, for sure. I'm not a scholar, I'm not a sheikh, I'm just a normal dude. Yeah. And that's why I just want to show people that any normal person can go out here and teach a message of God. Right. And my message is mainly to get people to worship God alone yeah. without any partners that need to. Okay, for I sure. don't care if you convert to Islam, I don't care what religion you are, as long as you worship the Creator alone. That's for my sure. message. Yeah, so I, you know what, and I appreciate you being honest about that, so I won't even, I won't, I won't press on that, because, so I, what I would do, I want you to do, if you can, like, because I, I, I will, in two weeks, I'll come back in two weeks. Do you think you can like do so a little? So I'm going to be flying out to Mecca oh, yeah, on, uh, on Halloween day. I'm okay. going to be flying out to Mecca. Okay. So if it's before that, then that's cool. Okay, I'll, yeah. I'll try to come next, you, next week. Well, you can hit me up on Instagram. Too. I will, yeah. You, you, I am the Warner? I am the Warner. Yeah, okay, for sure. You said that earlier. Okay. So, okay. So, yeah. If you can then, um, I'll come back on this subject. And if you can, like, like check out the textual variants that uh, Muslims are familiar with and stuff like that. Because I don't want to blind like blindside you with anything like that you know so yeah just check that out tell me and then i want to find out what you think and what you what you understand from that okay because uh this idea that the quran has been like it's it's a it's usually a um like uh it's a a, a statement used like saying this is how we know islam is true it's one of the miracles of the quran that the quran itself has been preserved unlike any other book like there's no book that has been perfectly preserved for 1400 years, uh, every letter, every word, and things of this nature. So, and that has a divine touch on it, you know? So, like, it, to me, if that is, if that is such a crux for Islam, it's such an important value to hold, I think that it's important to, to examine Challenge that. It. Yeah. Why not? Challenge yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I believe in true. challenging things. There's no problem. And I also, as Muslims, I, I encourage people to challenge Islam. I have no problem with people challenging Islam. Yeah. I welcome it. Yeah. Let's do it. Dude. For sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I'll, I'll let you go, man. This was this was good. I, I appreciated the conversation, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I, I think... Hey, I, so I think you got into it with Brother Issa Dawa and all of them too, huh? So we, we squashed we squashed our beef uh, yesterday. So, okay, you're, yes. you're God Logic, right? I'm God Logic. Okay, yes. okay, okay. I'm okay. Good. You so saw us. God Logic is a liar. I just saw the title. I just saw the the title yeah, yeah, yeah. God logic you know so it yeah. just like kind of started like yeah but for me bro I, I I deal with people like how I came to like you see like my individual is yeah. completely different because I'm not the lie bro I don't necessarily like the way that certain people are expressing the message of Islam I don't believe that's the Islamic way we're not supposed to be debating one another that's not the Islamic way yeah our, our thing is you simply deliver the message mm -hmm. it's up to them if they want to accept it or deny it's yeah. completely up to them yeah. they have the free will to decline the message of Islam. Yeah, no doesn't, doesn't make They're them a hater. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you know, they have the ability to do that. No yeah. problem. And same, I mean? and same yeah. with the, and the other way around. Like, I, I read a verse in the Quran that talks about uh, uh, discussing with the people hey, of the book. you have an English Quran? Do you yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I carry, I got, man, this, this, you see this, this, that's my baby right here. You okay, see it? Cool, cool, that's cool, my, cool. I carry, I carry her wherever I go, so. Well, do you uh, mind if I give you the clear Quran? Sure, okay. yeah, I'll take one. The more the merrier. Yeah, man. What's your, what's your uh, social media? Uh, God Logic Apologetics uh, on Instagram. You can look me up at uh, God Logic GL. 
one thing is like Muslims are extremely passionate, bro, about their beliefs. Yeah. And one thing, they're ready to go to war at any moment, bro. That's one thing about us, bro. Like we're, we're kind of built to we're built yeah. to fight, bro. We, we got we got people like that on our side yeah. too. Like there's yeah. there's people that <laughs> they can't separate the emotion yes. side of it and yes. they can only see Jesus ain't God. Yeah. Jesus didn't die and it's just red. Instead of why do you why do you say that? Why why do you believe that? Let's have Let, a yeah, exactly. But I think the, the, the debating style is not working, bro. I don't think it's working, bro. Yeah. I think it, it's it, causing more conflict. More division, yeah. A, instead of uniting one another. Because yeah. to, to be honest, Christians and Muslims have got along for so many years, bro. To a point where the, the masjid and the church would share the same wall yeah. and there was no conflict. Bro. Uh -huh. I personally believe this is all the work of the Jews trying to turn Christians and Muslims oh, really? against <laughs> each other. That's right? Big. Because, and the reason for that, because you have to remember that the Jews don't accept Jesus as the Messiah. Right. We accept Jesus as the Messiah. You accept Jesus as the Messiah. Right. Right. Who are the Jews waiting for right now? They're waiting for the false Messiah. Agreed. Right? We're both but, waiting but for I, the Messiah. I wouldn't, I wouldn't go so far to say that they're the ones that's pinning everybody. I, I, I believe, you I'll think say, so? I see it 100%. 100% I believe it's the Zionist Jews, because there's good Jews out there. Mm -hmm. But the Zionist Jews, right? They're the ones who are getting us to fight one another. So while we're, it's it's, it's called it's called a, a order out of chaos. You understand? Yeah. So they purposely get us to fight one another, right? So they could do, and so they could bring their false Messiah. And corrupt the world to where we are right now. That's 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 tough. I I wouldn't go. That's yeah, tough. no problem. I'm saying yeah. that. I have no but, problem but yeah. that. Yeah. That, that's interesting. Yeah, yeah. This is his opinion, not my opinion. <laughs> yes, yeah, so, yeah, so. But I truly believe it's the Zionist Jews that are trying to turn the Muslims and the Christians against one another. Because in Islam, it says that you are you guys are our closest allies. It does say that. Yeah. You guys are our closest allies. So for you guys to turn on us and for us to turn on you guys, it's it's not how so, it's supposed to be. So see that that's interesting too because. When I read the Quran, it has a lot of like a, a, a mixed statements when it comes to Christians. Like, like what you just said, it does say that they're the closest to the Muslims, yes. right? The the good ones among them. Yes, yes. But then it also says that like they're the they're the worst of creatures amongst with the, with the Jews and the like the polytheists in chapter ninety eight verse six. So we believe that that anyone anybody who claims that Jesus is God has chosen to disbelieve in God. Yeah. So now we don't put you guys in the category of those Christians because now we claim we we believe you guys are polytheists because now you guys are associating partners with God and you're worshiping outside of God. But what if I can show you that in the previous scriptures that that's what it taught that it taught that God Himself will come down. Take on I'm not form. gonna lie. I, I'm not willing to worship a God like that. Why? Because I believe that shows weakness to me. But do you, do you believe he could do anything? I believe that he could do everything, but he could he can't do things that are outside of his nature. For instance, he okay. can't he can't like uh, he can't create a, a rock that he can't. Lift. Yeah, that's a contradiction. Yeah. yeah. So what 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 is what is a human being is a limited being. So for an unlimited being to turn into a limited being. Well, so us, so, so that's not what we believe. Like yeah. so we don't believe that when God takes on human form. Yeah, yeah, I understand 100% the human one. Yeah, you're fully, God, fully God, yeah. fully man, right? So it's not that he's not God anymore and any less. that's 200% by the way. No, no, we don't say percentage. Yeah, yeah, we, yeah. we say fully man, fully God. So, you know, in the fullest sense, he is God. Well, in the I hear many sense, Christians say 100% man, that's, that's, inco God. that's incorrect language. That's 200%. Yeah, yeah that's, that's, that's incorrect. Well, I'm, like, I'm, I'm, I'm letting you know right yeah, now yeah. that that's incorrect language. Sure, sure, sure. And, I, and I hear Christians do that all the time. We got to correct that. Yeah. So that's improper language according to our creed. Yeah, fully man, fully God. And so... We don't believe that God loses a percentage or anything like that. What the Bible teaches is that what he did was is he uh, veiled himself in flesh. So I don't know if you know, so I actually, before coming to Islam, I was actually studying Christianity. Okay. I actually was thinking about uh, coming to Christianity, right? But when I started learning about like God and heaven as well, yeah. when it comes to Christianity and stuff like that, this is kind of what deterred me away. Because obviously I'm a, I'm a big unit, I'm not a small dude, you know what I mean? Yeah. So I, I want to worship something that I truly feel is supreme and almighty, right? Yeah. And when I read like the Quran and how it portrays who almighty God is, this is a God that I felt like I want to worship this God. Because it just comes off as such a supreme, almighty God, you know, and that's why, for me, I was like, this is a God that I want to worship. Do you do you believe that if God wanted to, that He could take on whatever form He wants and visit you, if He wanted to? No. So if, can He come in any form? No. I, I don't. I believe Almighty God will send people, see, send see. messengers, or send things. But if God comes Himself, we don't believe see, in that. See, well, how, that's that's the that's the issue because like. The Islam teaches in, in certain hadiths that Allah will come in a shape, in a form. 
that is even recognizable to Muslims, right? If you want, you could actually send those to me. I'll love oh, to look at it. For sure, for sure. Because sure. I actually still have, to, I still have a lot more studying for me. For to sure, do absolutely. Yeah, we, but I would love to. If, if you could send me that, I'll love to study more and yeah, learn more. To for be honest, sure. Because I'm always. I'm always a student. I'm always a student. I, I, yeah. I appreciate that, bro. Absolutely. Yeah, we can uh, we can wrap it up because I, I don't. Yeah, you guys got to go. Uh, this is I am a Warner. Yes, uh, my man Wahab, my yes, new friend. Yes, so check him out. Hey, so, so you from it. LA or what? Uh, yeah, I'm from around here. So yeah, I, I'm like only an hour away from here. Cool. Um, about an hour and a half from San Diego, so like in the middle. Cool, in the middle. Yeah, okay, it's pretty cool. So so maybe you could visit both of us, me and Jack Lamar. Heck yeah! No, seriously though, no, no, for real, kidding. man. I, I, I would though, because yeah, yeah, I'm down for it. I was like, I'm about to go talk to some random people right now about whatever. So about oh, the nice. existence so you're of God. About to do some preaching right now too. Yeah, yeah. Like that's, that's why I came, like you know, to get some you conversation. No, no, no. Just uh, inviting people to conversation on the camera. Well, like, so. I wish you the best, my dear brother. I appreciate you. Yes, you sir. too, man. Uh, so yeah, check them out, guys. Thank you for the conversation. Y'all be blessed. There's only one God. Only one God. Oh my God. Logic.